Backstage Pass, live at the Holmes Theatre here in Detroit Lakes, Minnesota. I am Becky Mitchell, and today I am joining me, Caitlin Norby, and Jen Sinclair. Welcome. Thanks. Thank you. And you guys are both part of the Gladys in Wonderland production mm -hmm. through Summit Productions, correct? Yes. Tell us a little bit about um, the play. How many, you, you've both been, you've been involved in the past, I know, so how, well, how many years have you been working together? Um, this is my third time working with Jim, um, second time directing him, and um, so the, the cast this year is a mix of people I've worked with before and, um, and haven't, so it's brought in a lot of uh, new fun characters, um, some new fun challenges, and um, exciting experiences on the stage. And Jim, you've been involved in Summit Productions for many years, I understand, correct? Yeah, about 22 years. Wow. <laughs> Summit Productions and Playhouse 412. Sure, yeah. sure. So Jim, you play a character in Gladys in Wonderland, and Caitlin, you are actually the director, mm -hmm. correct? Mm -hmm. So tell us a little bit about the story. Sure, well, um, I, I'm finding it difficult to kind of describe the story. Um, it's kind of about a depressing, com uh, depressing content, but it's actually a comedy. It's really funny. The characters are hilarious, I promise. Um, it follows the story of 87-year-old Gladys, who uh, wakes up one day and is greeted by her angel of death telling her it's time to go, and she's not having any of it. Not her time to go, she's decided. So they go through a couple scenarios of what her life would be like if she opts to not um, leave with her angel of death, and finally she decides maybe it is time to go. And so um, the, the sensitive moments are handled very sweetly, but the, the characters are funny, they're hilarious, the scenes she has to go through, um, they're making me giggle, and I've seen the show numerous times already, so um, I promise it's a comedy and it's, it's, it's great fun. And Jim, yeah. tell us a little, bit, a little bit about your character. What character do you play? I play Gladys's younger brother. Okay. Uh, who is um, not a very uh, friendly character, but a fun character. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and Gladys is played by? Jim's wife, Sharon. So there's a, a, a real life bond there, if you will, maybe a little extra poking that you can do oh, yes. at her character, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Sharon was actually going to join us today, but she's a little under the weather, correct? Yeah, she decided she'd be better off to stay home and rest up. Absolutely, mm -hmm. gotta rest those vocal cords as well. Yes. And there's quite a few vocal actors mm -hmm. in this production, correct? It's a to... cast of 11, um, myself, and then we have an assistant director, so there's 13 of us total, um, plus our stage crew, um, so it's, it's sometimes difficult to get all those people together, but it's a great crowd. Um, it's a it's a nice sized cast and makes for a, a good variety of personalities up there and talents. And are these all members that have participated in plays before, or do we have any new actors? Or um, they've all been there before, uh, participating in a few different shows. Uh, my assistant's brand new to the area, so she this is her first time with Summit Productions, which is great. We're always looking for new people, so we're excited to have some new blood in Summit Productions. Um, but the rest of them. I know I take that back. We also have another newbie on stage. So it's a good combination this year. Good. Well, I'm going to interject right now and just remind our viewers that the uh, Gladys in Wonderland happens on Thursday, February 27th and February 28th at 7.30 mm -hmm. p.m. Mm -hmm. For tickets, you can call the box office at 844-7469 or visit our website at www.dlccc.org. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to let you guys go out um, acting, a, reading from the play, if sure. you will, a little scene. Sure. Mm -hmm. So um, I'll be reading the part of Gladys since Sharon is missing today, and um, Jim will be frank as usual. So, can I get you some coffee? Oh, no. Never drink coffee. Can't remember the last time I drank coffee. I drink it all the time. And what do you do with the cup after you drink that stuff? Usually I wash it out. You get yourself a magnifying glass and take a good close look at the inside of that cup. That's what I did. I don't want my insides looking like that. That's why I started drinking water. Nothing but water. Five times a day. Don't you ever get tired of plain old water? No. Myrna and I have come up with a whole range of taking it in. Believe you me. I get up in the morning, I can't wait to get to the table. That's when Myrna gives me my mug. Warm H2O starts the day off with a bang, I'll tell you. All right, we'll stop there. All right, well, Just join us February 27th and 28th at the Home Theater for Gladys in Wonderland. Thank you.